Hey, I wanted to show a lessons learned that I picked up doing, um, I was working on some wiring this morning, trying to get this wellhead done for my DC water system. So I have the pump down there. It's been running for a few weeks. I just wanted to make sure everything was cleaned out really good. So finally got back and, uh, Last night, what I did is I went ahead and put that well wire in PVC uh, conduit. And I'm starting to bury that over here. And uh, <clears throat> so what I forgot to do, this is a big lesson learned, is I didn't turn off the power to the controller. And what I did was, you know, I went ahead and put the wire in the, the PVC conduit. And these wires here, I had to pull out, obviously, to run the conduit. I put them back in and there was a short. And uh, I, I figured, man, what the heck did I do? And then over here, this there was this air, um, air LED it was on. And man, I thought I fried my controller. I'd be out another 850 bucks, you know, for a pump and controller. I didn't know what was going on. All I know is I was kind of scared. Didn't sleep well last night knowing I screwed this up. I gotta have this done today for, for somebody, somebody can live in this. Uh, this weekend anyway so what i found i want to show you this what i found is um i wanted to put a clamp of some sort in the wellhead and what i did is i took this piece of steel it's actually a mending plate for my uh, greenhouses that i design and, and build for people but i went wrapped that with quite a bit of duct tape and then what i did is i just uh you know used some self-driving self-driving screws over here to go ahead and hold it into place. And then I thought it was a good idea. That way the wire over time, it, it's kind of deep. I have it taped off on the on the pipe, but man, it's kind of deep and I didn't want it to sag in there over time. So what I ended up finding was when I cinched it down, even with that duct tape to give some stress relief, is I went ahead and severed the insulation on all three of my lines. So I didn't short my controller. I didn't damage any of the, you know, pump capacitors or whatever happens to be down there. It was something simple, but boy, I was kind of scared there for a sec. The two horse pump and controller, I've been really impressed with it. It's neat. And it's it's run quite a while without any problems. Um, it's just this little scare. Luckily it was something small and easy to fix. So I'll just wrap some electrical tape on there, mount it back in, be done. But, um, Boy, that was kind of scary there for a sec. Anyway, just thought I'd share that with you. One of those in-field lessons learned. Hey, you have a good one. Bye.